So I was doing a bit of uh, weeding and came across a bit of dog poop. And I was digging out the grass because I want the foxgloves to have all this territory. And every time I'm gonna replant the self seed them again. So this is a dung beetle. So all creatures great and small, I'm mindful of. So, and dung beetles are a vital part of my farming system for mining minerals and vitamins and bringing them up to the surface as they dig their hole. So I've got this box here and I'm going to put the dung beetle in here like that. Then I'm gonna go and get some horse manure and put it on top. And that way I'll have rescued a dung beetle. Isn't that right, Maya? You good girl. So now go to the stables or the shed so that this dung beetle can have food for the rest of the winter. A nice fresh pile of manure that I'm gonna put on top of. You can see the dung beetle is right in there. So the dung beetle can have food. So there we go. Lovely fresh manure so that that dung beetle. Now herbivore manure is not like human manure. So I don't mind handling it with my hands. And anyway, I wash my hands. My hands have seen a lot worse things. So this dung beetle, I'm now gonna put in a protective place. By the way, nobody's lambing. Everybody's just hanging out and eating food. So I'm now gonna put this in a protective location so it doesn't frost. Because the dung beetle, I could feel it moving on the palm of my hand. So I'll put this in a protective location so that uh, the dung beetle, when it's had its full and the winter's over, it can climb out of this container and fly away and lay more dung beetles or fertilize more dung beetles because I don't know if that was a boy or a girl dung beetle. Anyway, all creatures great and small must be minded and that's me doing my bit for dung beetles just today.